Yeah, we got a nice little BenQ monitor now, guys, provided by my boy J God. You know, shout out to J God of the RL series, by the way. I'm not sure exactly what like the number is or whatever, but um, it's a 27 inch monitor uh, coming from my 32 inch uh, TV. It's not that big of an adjustment, so it actually works out for me really well. So what's up, guys? It's here here by the or Quadigy, and you guys just saw my BenQ. It's a really, really great monitor. And you guys will be seeing my first gameplay with the BenQ. Actually, my first life with the BenQ here shortly. I'll basically explain how the BenQ monitor helps and other monitors as well uh, in improving your gameplay on uh, World War II. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm going to be very informative as to how the monitor helps me and improve my gameplay. And uh, let me know if you have a monitor as well. Let me know if you have a TV. And if you went from a TV to a monitor like recently, or if you remember the experience, let me know in the comments as well about your experience. So, uh, let's get to the gameplay. And here we are with the gameplay, guys. We rock in the PPSH, and we're going to get the lobby, and it's pretty quite spicy here. And literally, this is my first life. And I had just recently gotten my monitor. I went out outside of my house to get the monitor from my boy J-God. He actually hand-delivered the monitor to me because he's a big baller. And I got the monitor. Here I got my first kill. I was like, oh, snap, what the heck? I feel like I'm melting like crazy right now. So, as you can tell here, I'm just, like, very, very accurate with my shots. I know what I'm doing. And, like, I'm challenging everything that I can because I just feel that confident with a monitor. The moment that I got that first kill, I was like, okay, this is a serious, serious change. Um, I'm just out here just melting everybody. It's, like, really, really easy for me. And the thing with the monitor, it helps your response time, basically. So, every TV, I think, has, like, a higher, uh, like, a higher delay in response time from, like, 10 milliseconds and up. The BenQ monitor that I have, I think it's a 1 millisecond, like, delay. So, basically, there's almost no delay at all, um, you know, in, like, showing the image on the TV. Or on the monitor, I should say. So the monitor is pretty much almost in real time as to what's actually happening in the game. So in most gunfights, I'm going to have the first shot on people. You know, as long as like connection is actually good on my side. And I pretty much will win gunfights most of the time if I'm like aiming down sights first. And like, I won't be like, I won't get most of those shoot first, die first kind of situation. You know what I mean? Because that's why I'm doing shoot first, die first. That's either lag or a really bad like TV. That has a very, very high delay. Or, you know, delay that's not as good as a, a monitor's delay. So here I pick up the bar. And right there, I probably would have died if I didn't have a monitor, like, in that instant where I ran away. Because the monitor allowed me to tell that, like, people were going to come that way really, really fast. A TV would have been a little bit more slower. And those guys would have most likely killed me because I wouldn't have the reaction time in order to get away from that. Uh, situation as you can tell here I'm being very very careful because I know people are camping or not they're not camping but they're like spawning in the back over there and then they're camping so I don't want to be in that situation with like a PPSH or even a bar because snipers will be killing me in that situation you know I'm not gonna be the advantageous one in that in that state and here with the bar I'm just able to pick people off from a distance that's why I picked up the bar because I knew the PPSH wasn't gonna help me in this spawn that's why I'd rather have them spawn uh, on the other side, on C side, I believe. Because on C side, I can definitely control the, the area better with a PPSH. This side, you need like an AR to control. You know, you gotta know the, the strengths and disadvantages of every uh, gun that you have. And right there, that's another like, he shot me first, but I was able to kill him because I, I was able to have the aim and the precision and the response time to kill that guy in that last gunfight. That's why I came out red. In most of these gunfights, I don't really come out red at all. I used to come out red in many, many gunfights before. But now, I just like peek and destroy people really, really easily. I legit feel like a tank. I already feel like I have specialist bonus even without having specialist bonus to begin with. And that's a very weird concept to wrap your head around. But it works. It legit works, guys. I'm not sure how much a monitor like this would, would cost. But right here, as you guys can tell... First round, and I'm already 22-0, and 0, which is insane to me. Like, I'm just destroying everybody, like, with no hesitation. Like, look at this. I just killed this guy, killed that guy. 
And I'm just ready to kill the third guy right here around the corner. Like, it's legit too easy of a monitor. Like, I don't think I'm the greatest World War II player. And I still don't think I'm the greatest World War II player with a monitor. But I could definitely tell you guys my experience with World War II has gotten better. And I've been enjoying the game a little bit more. Which is good because I'm going to be ready for Black Ops 4. And especially the beta when it comes out in a couple weeks here. A couple weeks and a half, I should say. So... I think it's definitely worth to get a monitor. I have a BenQ monitor. I've heard from many people that ASUS monitors are actually better. You know, ASUS monitors. I think that's how you uh, spell the, the brand or whatever. I heard that they're actually better than BenQ monitors. You know, I was given this monitor for free. So I, I definitely wanted to, you know, try out a monitor and see if it would help me. And just just from this monitor that uh, JGod gave me, I could already tell that I was playing a ton better. You know, I feel more confident in everything that I just uh, encounter and just... I'm a more confident player overall, and that's what I really lacked as a player. As we get the V2 rocket in Call of Duty World War II. Like, now I feel more confident. I'm not afraid to challenge gunfights. I mean, you should still be smart, as you guys are going to see here uh, when I die. You should still be smart. You don't believe that you're, like, a god god uh, when you have a monitor on, obviously, and specialist bonus. But you, you still want to be smart for, with most of your engagements. And we get that nice little vicious metal right there, too. And we're going to keep going as well here. It's just... The monitor just helps you so much. But, um, yeah, you still want to play carefully. You obviously want to play to your gun strengths. But most gunfights, you, you won't feel like you're getting BS unless there's some kind of lag involved. Like, on stream, I'm still going to have BS devs. Just because my, my upload and my download isn't the best. And when I stream, it kind of, like, takes a chunk of that. You know, from my PS4 that's, uh, you know, using up the internet as well. So, obviously, I'm still going to have, like, some BS devs. But I, I found that I'm I'm even I'm still co more consistent on stream than I was before, uh, with this small change. It's a small change, but I can like hereby say that a monitor will give you an advantage over TV. So if you guys have the money to get some kind of monitor, any kind of monitor, even if it's kind of old, as long as you get some kind of like less delay, it helps a lot. And right here, like I told you guys, don't believe that you're a god, because in that situation, I should have ran away. Instead of trying to challenge the third person. I was, I, did, I was just feeling really, really confident at the time. And I had already gotten my V2 rocket. So I wanted to carry on the streak. I should have ran away until I killed those two guys. And just, you know. Because I had special bonus. So I could have ran away. You know. I had time to run away. I was on the floor. That guy couldn't kill me. It wasn't until I pushed that I died. And if you guys haven't seen this gameplay. This was a 92 kill streak. Using pistols. And I want to say it's probably thanks to the monitor. That I was even able to get this gameplay. So make sure you guys check yesterday's video. If you want to see the the, the the remainder of this gameplay. Because this gameplay is probably my one of my best gameplays on the channel right now. So it's a banger. 92 kill streak, 120 kills almost with pistols. The new variant that just came out. So yeah. I want to show you guys my PPSH class setup here in a bit. And so uh, yeah. So yeah guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed that gameplay. And as you guys could tell, it, it really is a game changer. I mean, you guys can't really tell from the, the gameplay itself. But I can assure you guys that if you, were to, if you were to get a monitor and you transition to a monitor from a TV, it really does make a difference, in my opinion, from what I felt. You guys wanted to see the class setup? This is the class setup itself. I was running grip, long barrel, and extended mags on the PBSH just melting everybody in my sight. And I had to run that specialist with that And I had to run that specialist with that armored division because armored it gives you no freaking flinch pretty much. And specialist man it's just it's the big baller basic training, you know. I become a tank with all the basic trainings and it's just too easy with the C4 as well and the flags that gives me my double kills, my triple kills or my what beats that allows me to body everybody you already know so yeah hopefully this video kind of informs you in a way of how the monitors do help it's not a a big difference i would say but it's a big difference enough to mean a difference between life and death in each gunfight so in that case it is kind of a big difference if i made any sense in saying that so thank you for all the love and support i absolutely freaking love you all leave a like if this video helped you at all and uh, let me know what kind of monitor you have if you do have a monitor. I freaking love you all. Keep being big ballers. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.